All right, so in the past week, we have gotten a new Marvel Rivals release date trailer. For those of you not familiar, this game is essentially a multiplayer game, kind of like an Overwatch, or I would even compare it to the Heroes versus Villains mode in Star Wars Battlefront 2. It's pretty simple. You have two teams against each other and you get to pick which hero you're going to be. And every single character has their own unique abilities that you can master. Personally, I love this type of game. I can play Battlefront 2 for hours on end. I love the competitiveness of this type of game. All right, so let's Let's not waste any more time and watch this official launch date trailer. Um, hopefully, it's soon. Among the stars, Wakanda found a new home. In the animation style, a new hope. It's a bit more uh, the of an exaggerated. Kind of like anime. I'm not really too big into anime, but the game looks fun. Snap out of it, Bucky. No. Not so fast. Your battle's over. Some Winter Soldier gameplay. I haven't, I haven't seen this yet. Is that a thing he can do in the comics? Maybe? Like an alien arm? Dude, Captain America. That'd be fun. He's probably like a tank. I haven't seen any gameplay. Um. Oh, shoot. Doom. December 6th. Ugh. All heroes unlocked and free to play at launch and beyond. Well, that's sick. Ugh, December 6th, though. I wasn't able to play the, the beta this summer. I just got finished moving into a new house, so I had no time to test out this game on console. Let's take a look at what characters we have to play as, because I don't really remember all of them. Oh, we have the Punisher. I see Adam Warlock, Iron Man, uh, obviously Loki. Oh, I'm trying to think of characters that you wouldn't normally think of. Is that Magneto at the very, very far left? It looks like it. I love these types of games because each character can have a completely different ability set than the person you're fighting. And you also have to be mindful of your opponent's abilities. So it's just this really cool back and forth. And that's one reason why Battlefront 2 playing heroes versus villains is one of my favorite game modes to play because you have to be aware of every ability of every character in order for you to properly, you know, do good in a match. You have to be aware of cooldowns and can this person do a choke right here can i counter that what's like all that stuff is so fun to me the main reason i'm super super excited for this game even though it's coming out december 6th that that hurts man it's because playing battlefront i was pitching this kind of game i was like dude imagine a game where you can play as the hulk and you, you're a brute right and and a big character like that could be for your beginners where they have a lot of health they can do a lot of damage but if you know what you're doing and you're a skilled player you could probably easily defeat them. Thinking about how cool it would be to see Spider-Man fighting the Hulk or like another big character like the Thing. Magneto as a character seems like a super cool idea. I haven't seen any gameplay of his. I hope there's specific objects lying around the map that only he can pick up. So you can choose your play style. Maybe you just want to play as your favorite character. That's probably what I'm going to do. I'm going to play as Spider-Man a lot. And you know, in my case, I've also been looking for a game that I could stream regularly on this channel. And this is like perfect because it's like quick, competitive fun. I'm not a big fan of the over-exaggerated anime style that they're going for, but they probably did that because it's easier to render than trying to make everything look photo real. Let me know if you guys are going to play this game. And if you are, what character would you pick just based on your favorite character? Or who do you think is going to be the most OP in this game? As always, I appreciate you guys watching this channel so much. Stay tuned for more videos. And I'll see you in the next one.